Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Daytime with Kimberly and Esteban. I'm Carla Salinas, and today we are right outside the HEB Park in Edinburgh, where on October 31st, you can come for a day full of food, music, and family fun for the Carnaval de Calaveras Dia de los Muertos Festival. The Carnaval de Calaveras will be the first stadium festival in South Texas since the start of the pandemic. We met up with Shalimar Madrigal, who spoke to us about what people can expect at the festival. We know that Halloween is a big part of our culture. We celebrate it with our kids, with our families, we get together, we trick or treat. We're very social, it's a cultural thing. Uh, and this year's gonna look a little bit different and we realize that. So we wanted to offer families an opportunity to come together, to have a great time as a family, at, to do something, to get out of the house and do something, but in a very safe and socially distant manner. Uh, as you can see, we have plenty of space. It is outdoors, it's safe. Um, people will be six feet apart, uh, at least six feet apart, in our stands. Each family, you can purchase tickets in groups of two, three, four, or six, and there will be six feet of distance um, in front of, behind, and to the sides of each group. So when you look at the stands, there will be people in the stands. They're gonna be very socially distant. And then we'll also have pods on the grass. It's a, a unique experience. You know, when you go to the drive and you sit in your car, well, now you can pack a picnic, uh, bring a blanket, you can lay, lay down. The event will be featuring Disney's hit movie, Coco, a story about Dia de los Muertos. And then we'll have a concert with Grupo Solido afterwards to close off the night. We're gonna have food, we're gonna have fun. Uh, there's gonna be music. It's gonna be a way for families to come together in a socially distanced and safe manner and also a very affordable manner. Our tickets start at just $20 uh, in the stands and in the pods, it comes out to $25 per person. Um, so it's very affordable, it's safe, it's family fun. If you're looking for something to do, not quite comfortable with doing the whole trick-or-treating thing, like I said, it's gonna look a little different this year. So we wanted to offer you this option. Shalimar explains, this is a great opportunity to celebrate and have some fun after the tough year. And we celebrate, we've lost a lot in the past six months, right? So the de los Muertos is a day where we honor the dead, we celebrate their lives. So it's an opportunity to not only teach the little ones about an important part of Hispanic culture, but to celebrate life, to just come together and have a really good time in a safe environment. So get your Dia de los Muertos makeup and outfit ready for October 31st. Get dressed up, have fun. Uh, I suspect I'm gonna be wearing my Dia de los Muertos face paint and get all into it. It's been a rough six months. We need something to celebrate, to have fun. So yes, absolutely. We encourage people to come out, to get the kids dressed up, have a good time. That's what we do. Get your tickets for the Carnaval today.